All right, next up tonight, 2014 Bowman Jumbo Case Break number 19. Andrew B's got his Brewers. Angelo M has his Mets. Brett S with the Nationals. Corey's got the Diamondbacks. Eric P. Astros, Royals, and Dodgers. Jacob N has the White Sox. John G with the Rangers. John M has the Yankees. Josh Y with the Orioles. Jules has the Reds, Phillies, and Cardinals. Mark B with the Red Sox and Cubs. Uh, Mike S. Mariners and Blue Jays. Nate N with the Rays. Rasmus has Braves, Marlins, A's, and Padres. Rocco's got the Pirates. Samuel L has the Indians. Scott A with the Rockies. Scott R with the Twins. Serenity, she's in it. Has the Angels. Theodore Y with the Giants. And Tom R with the Tigers. Gosh, I love Bowman. How did we go a night without Bowman last night? What? Well, we did Bowman Sterling, but that doesn't count. There should never be a Bowman Jumbo list night here. At least until I run out of cases. Which is not going to be very long. Did you guys see the price of Jumbos went up again? They're going to be like $200 a box pretty soon. Watch. They're really hard to find. And they're going up again. I don't really know why, but they are. There you go. Let's do this. Steve the Sleever's primed and ready. Oh, already a green autograph. Watch. Yep. Green autograph. Ronnie Bautista. John M's Yankees. 66 of 75 to start us out. Make sure we didn't miss a, anything there. And we didn't. Sweet Caroline. <laughs> Miguel Sano, top 100. Daniel Polka, refractor, Paul Polka's brother. He should be named Paul Polka. All right, fill that NT. Die cut to 99, who is it? David Dahl for the Rockies. That's Scott. David Dahl, numbered 93 of 99. Archie Bradley, mini refractor. I shall call it a mini refractor. Max Freed Mini, Bo Jackson Sparkle. Anthony Renato and a uh, Ubaldo Jimenez Ice. On the board. <laughs> so you're telling me there's a chance. Felix Hernandez, blue paper. Eric Johnson, top 100. It's a quiet Thursday, at least so far. Everyone ready for the long weekend? I bet a lot of people are taking vacation early, huh? That must be what's going on. I know Jules and Ryan are out of here. Living it up on vacation. And look at Scott. Ramel Tapia autograph for Scott's Rockies. He's on fire. Is that who you bought the Rockies for, Scott? Tapia or the other guy? Because you'll get the other guy. There's always two. <coughs> Rockies autographs comes in come in pairs. There's a Clayton Kershaw orange James Ramsey mini. Four tens. That's nice. Okay, I was wrong. There's no more Rockies autographs in this box, but there is an Adam Morgan for the Phillies refractor auto. Jules! 389 of 500. They'll have to watch that on the replay.
Oh, blue wave pack. I didn't even look. I was looking at the chat. I didn't even see it. Come on, autograph. Nomar Mazzara. Akil Morris. Tyler Marlette. Ryan Eads. Edwin Diaz. You know, it's been forever since we had a black wave pack. Hawk Julie. I have a good military contingent cardsmith breaks. I love military guys. They're good. Billy Hamilton Mini, Christian Bethencourt Ice, and a Preston Tucker Black Refractor for Houston, 98 of 99. Thus concluding box number one. So what percentage, I don't know anything about the military. What percentage of people that enlist and go to like basic training just can't do it and leave? Not saying it's gonna happen to you, Brett. I just wonder like, is it like, you know, 99% of the people just do it all and it's fine? Or are there a lot of people that think they can do it and then get there and they're like, I can't do this? Or how does that work? Uh, Bartolo Colon Blue, and look at this, Rosel Herrera, I told you, there's an almost never one Rockies autograph, it's always both of those guys, every time, go back and watch the, the cases, I swear, I swear it to be true, they don't let you out, yeah, that's what I was thinking, Devin Williams, Prove craziness. Chase Anderson, blue paper. Zach Borenstein. I mean, what if you... Okay, what if you go to basic training? Again, not that this is going to happen to you, Brett. I'm sure it's going to be amazing. But what if you go... And you're... You just... Anthony Renato mini blue wave and you just like after the first day you're like I don't I can't it's just not for me and you go like talk to someone what, what are they do they yell at you <laughs> I shouldn't even be saying this since we have somebody going sorry Jesse Winker for the Reds Jules you can flunk out yeah I just don't know anything about it I just find it interesting I don't know like if they try to get people to quit because they only want certain people or they want everybody, I don't know anything about it. Yeah, Garen Cecchini Mini, Craig Kimbrell Ice. Oh, really? Oh, that's a blue rookie auto. Hold on. Everyone. <laughs> uh, Colton Wong, did they buy him? Jules, another Colton Wong blue. Oh, mama. Yeah. 207 of 250. Colton Wong blue. I mean, I imagine if you sign up for the military, whatever it is, and you make, I mean, you, you know, fly all the way out to basic training and all that, you're probably pretty much committed. It's not like people would just do that over the weekend. Like, oh, I think I'll sign up and go fly out and start basic training. I'm not sure if I really want to do it yet. <laughs> Jeff Samarja Ice. Did I hear that Jeff Samarja got traded? And did the Dodgers get him? Tyler Skaggs, Blue Paper. Billy Hamilton. Logan Vick, Indians, Blue Refractor. 90 of 250. Really? Alan Hansen. Oh, he hasn't been traded yet. He's like on the block or something. 
I was watching PTI like in the background and they said something about happy trails, Jeff Samarja, and I was like, oh my gosh, he's he's actually a really good pitcher. Daniel Polka. He has like the best ERA over ten starts and no wins or something. I'm I'm fascinated with the military because it's like the opposite of my of me in my life. I don't I could just I can't ever see myself doing that. Not my thing. I don't know anything about it. I don't even really know anybody personally who's in the military. Lucas Sims Mini. <laughs> Jeez. That's crazy. First Cy Young winner without a win. What if a guy had like zero ERA for the entire season, but like somehow kept being taken out or like losing and he, he had a losing record and had a zero ERA? <laughs> oh, that would be impossible. What if he had a sub two ERA and went like five and 18 or something? Jacob Scavuzzo for the Dodgers. King Felix. <laughs> yeah. Caleb Cowart. Chris Medlin. So let me ask you this. Since obviously we have military people. This is going to be Bowman Case 19 slash military talk. I want to learn more. Ooh, look at this Abreu blue paper. That's not bad. 391 of 500. A brand new blue paper. Jonathan Scope. So, let me ask you a question. When you're... What do they call it when you're on leave or whatever? When you're on leave. Let's say, you know, you're doing your military stuff. <laughs> I don't know anything about the military. When you get to go on your leave and, like, you know, not be wherever you are in the military, Victor Sanchez, do you feel like a total badass when you're walking around? Any Romero ice? Because everyone must just look at you and, like, love you and say thanks to you and does it feel amazing when you go out in public with your uniform on and stuff and everyone like is nice to you well is everyone nice to you first off they should be Edwin Diaz black refractor auto shore leave 59 of 99 Edwin Diaz for Michael S nice black refractor auto Eric Hosmer, orange paper. Taiwan Walker Mini. But aren't there some branches or where you have to wear like your full on You know, you have to wear your uniform, so how does that work? <laughs> Wei and Chen blue paper. Just explain everything about the military to me in about thirty minutes. Because, you know, you see people that are in their uni their full-on uniform. It's like, ooh, there's a gold. Oh, I know who that is. Rasmus? I think this is yours. Oh, that's nice. Jason Hirsch, gold refractor. He's good, dude. This is one of those sleeper prospects. He's not like a four-star, but this is one of those guys that people say is, like, underrated. Forty-two of fifty. Rasmus, nice hit. You better grade that. In fact, you are grading that. I'm not shipping that to you until it's in a slab. Matt Kane, blue paper. Victor Sanchez. Jamie Westbrook to five hundred refractor. I'll tell Steve the Sleever to be extremely careful with your gold, Jason Hirsch. Yeah, you got a bunch of golds. 
Rasmus, you didn't grade anything from the the five casers. Why not? Didn't or did you? No, I don't think you did. What was up with that? Sorry to call you out right now publicly in front of everybody, but we should have got your stuff in for grades. I dropped the ball on that. Corey Neville, Mini Refractor, Jacoby Ellsbury, Sparkle. After after my 75% 9-5 ratio on the Bowman. Did it get hot in here again? Even with the air conditioner? Oh, it's all blowing on you. I direct all the air conditioner on Steve the Sleever because he's a prima donna. Museum is on the calendar. It's uh, Leaf Trinity next, which is a pretty short break. Preston Tucker for the Astros autograph. Trinity football takes like, what, 20 minutes? So, probably the rest of this break is maybe 20 minutes with a hit recap. Jackie Bradley Jr., I don't know, 45 minutes maybe? But I thought you're so, so when I see people wearing their military uniform, they don't have to do that. Jared Weaver Green. Are there some branches or some whatever units that have to wear it? Or are they just that's totally voluntary? So when I see a guy wearing his uniform out in public, should I assume that he's just like trying to show off? <laughs> oh, on duty. Okay. Coming from duty. What if they're doing a duty? Lance McCullers. Curtis Granderson. Okay. But like, can you be on duty, but you don't have to actually do anything? <laughs> like, you're, is it like being on call? Marco Scudero, blue. Did you know this is not Marco Scudero on the picture, by the way? Yes, I'm collecting, I'm collecting vital military information from you guys about wearing your uniform because I want to be Rambo. First step in becoming Rambo is knowing can I wear my uniform in public. That's really the key thing. You know, I haven't asked you guys about... Oh, wait, gold mini. I'll shut up for a second. For just a second. Chris Taylor for the Mariners. Mike S. 22 of 25. Gold mini. There's Mike S. Oh, that's a refractor for Miguel Alfredo Gonzalez of the Phillies. I haven't asked you any tactical questions that would allow me to actually become any kind of military or <laughs> any kind of, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? You know, threatening force like Rambo. Oops, no Syndergaard Mini. Knowing is half the battle. No, we're not hating on the military, not at all. Christian Binford, there's a lot of military guys in the chat right now, so I'm just kind of asking them. This is sort of like ask a military guy night. If you have any questions about the military that aren't offensive and weird and stupid, like my stupid questions. None of my questions are stupid. Roman Quinn Mini, Matt Moore Ice. Uh, yeah, I am getting more Prism. I think I'd, I'm not going to have it by tomorrow. It'll be early next week. We'll do more... Uh, Anyway, from what I understand... Oh, here's a blue auto. Who's that? Diamondbacks? Daniel McGrath. How many... Rasmus, we have not hit a lot of Daniel McGraths. True or false? Mark B. Boston Red Sox. Blue. 76 of 150. Are you guys going to fill that hockey mixer? You're really disappointing me. We're in the heat of the playoffs, and I put... A mixer with two boxes of the cup, two prim, two dominions and two primes. Tanaka mini. You're in the military too. Who isn't in the military? 
Irving, you're in the military? Anyways, what I was going to say about being Rambo. As far as being Rambo, I think the only thing you have to do is make, like, tree branch spike things that gore people, <laughs> impale people to death when they walk by them. That's the main thing I learned, and that's what I, that's the one skill I've been working on. I'm really good at making spikes on a, out of a tree that gore people. CJ Cron. Yeah, shooting arrows. Good call. Shooting arrows, that's another one. Ryan Zimmerman. Trevor Bauer. <laughs> Not a liberty to answer. <laughs> First Blood is awesome. I've watched that a million times. Here's a funny story about First Blood. Seth Mayhouse Breen. I watched First Blood with Seth Mayhouse Breen. Jules! No. You guys remember when... Now, try to remember back, like, a long, long time ago. This would be, like, 2005. You remember when Blu-rays were new and, like, there was HD DVDs? And you go to Blockbuster. Now... Some of you kids might not remember Blockbuster, but there used to be this video store called Blockbuster, and you go in there and rent DVDs and Blue, Blue Waves. Blu, Blue Rays. Blue Waves. You could rent Blue Wave Bowman autographs. So anyway, Jake Johansson. Back in 2005, Evan Gass, I had a PS... Wait, is PS3 the one that has the first Blu-ray player? It wasn't PS2, right? No. <laughs> 2005. Oh, the Rambo knife. Dude, maybe when I was a kid. I, that sounds really familiar now. Anyways, you're, you're sidetracking me. Jonathan Singleton in a blue Wilmer Becerra. Hollywood video. 46. So anyway, this, the story I'm trying to get to is my friend and I, when I got the play, I think I got the PlayStation like right when it came out, you know, and yeah, I got the PS3 when it came out. And we would go to Blockbuster near my house to try to find Blu-rays to even watch because there was, like, nothing. It wasn't like now where you just get a Blu-ray from every single movie you want to watch easily. You'd go to Blockbuster and there'd be, like, one shelf with, like... I mean, it started out with, like, 10 or 15 Blu-rays. Jake Marisnik autograph. Miami. That's Rasmus. So, anyway... <clears throat> we, uh, we'd go over there and look through the movies and there'd just be a bunch of terrible Blu-rays we didn't want to watch. And, like, <laughs> I think two out of three times we went there, we saw Rambo First Blood and we were like, uh, let's just watch that again. Like, <laughs> it looked really good on Blu-ray and it was, like, the best movie sitting there on Blu-ray, like, every time. And I just remember we were joking about how, like, we would almost literally just go over there and rent First Blood on Blu-ray every time. And it was good every time. I don't know how I bought that. I did not have any money at all. I don't know why why I bought a PS3. I think it's because I was just really into games. KB Toys. Do you ever just go to KB Toys at the mall and just walk around and never buy anything but like have a have a pretty good time for like 30 minutes just looking at stupid toys? I did that like a hundred times. Jose Abreu mini refractor. It's all junk too. I have a Nova Ice. KB Toys had like all these weird fake toys. They're not even real. Jared Weaver, Gray Paper, and Armando Rivero for the Cubbies. Mark B. Yeah, let's add a. Someone start a new discussion thread. What do they have exclusives on? Also, I didn't realize there was toy exclusives. 
I'm ignorant to the toy business. G.I. Jeff. <laughs> G.I. Jeff. Huds isn't from Canada, so they have all kinds of weird stuff up there. Do they also have, like, Rattlesnake Commander? Derek Holland. Dylan Bundy Mini. Remember G.I. Jeff's arch enemy, Rattlesnake Commander? Uh, Zach Lee Mini for the Doyers. I knew you'd laugh at that, Huds. We're all angels, Serenity. All of us, each and every one of us is a perfect angel. Wendell Riho. Mark B's Red Sox. He's a pretty good prospect. Seth Stroh. <laughs> Cobra Commander is so awesome. He's one of the best bad guys. Daniel McGrath again. Okay, Rasmus, scratch that. We all, we obviously have a zillion Daniel McGraths. I was lying. I don't think we've had any angels yet. Reimer Liriano, Joey Votto, Ice. Why are these all upside down? <laughs> I'm trying to think what I ever bought from KB Toys. Jameson Tyon. Zach Bornstein, Blue Mini. There you go, that's the Angels. Blue Wave Mini, 152 of 250. Pat Stover for the Doyers. Blue Refractor, 189 of 250. It's a green autograph. Who is it? It's Wendell Riho again. Holy crap. Red Sox doing very well. Circuit City. 32 of 75 Wendell Riho Green Refractor now. Again with the Wendell Rehos. Welcome to Circuit City. Our service is state of the art. Adam Lynn Green. Chris Owings Mini. Circuit City sucked. Anthony Rendon, uh, gold paper to 50. Gregory Polanco mini. Circuit City is the same with Best Buy. You just always feel like no one knows what they're talking about. Daniel Norris Mini Refractor. Here's a Corota Ice. <laughs> it's the too many conversations, that's why it's getting all laggy. Austin Meadows. Mason Williams. Blue Wave Mini. Yeah, we talk about, sometimes I just feel like, like tonight's a weird night. There's not a lot of stuff going on. Plus, I've been breaking for 10 straight days and I'm starting to get a little delirious and bored. JR Graham Mini, so we'll just make up weird stuff to talk about. We do it from time to time. Can't do it all the time, otherwise it gets annoying. Elvis Andrews, Yellow Paper. I try to make stuff, I try to be entertaining for you guys so it's not boring sometimes. Sometimes products are so good I don't have to say anything because it's so entertaining. Bowman's good but we've also done like 40 cases of it so. And there's a lot of base. <laughs> Dumb and Dumber Night. J.R. Murphy, Rookie Refractor Auto. John M. 
403 of 500. Slippy, slappy, swami. Look on the briefcase. <laughs> Swanson. Oh. For the Giants, printing plate one of one. Brian Ragira. Theodore Y. I was way off. It's probably unlisted. Wow. <laughs> the little hot air below after that. It's probably unlisted. Wow. Don't get me started on Dumb and Dumber again. John Gant Blue Paper. Miguel Sano Mini Refractor. There's no way the new Dumb and Dumber is going to be good. I have, I'm going to have no expectations at all. I don't want to be crushed. Disappointed. CJ Cron Mini. Coming up next is Museum Collection. Number 17, I think. And then we've got a hockey, hockey mixer we're trying to fill. Could be epic. Julio Urias Mini. Estrubo Cabrera Ice. Adam Jones, Blue Paper. Matt Davidson, Top 100. The <laughs> new Mrs. Doubtfire. There is a new Mrs. Doubtfire, huh? That's not a joke. Micah Johnson. Oh, Trinity's next, sorry. You're right. That's why Rasmus is here, to keep me in check, because I'm an idiot. There's no quote from Dumb and Dumber that I don't know. You can't stump me on Dumb and Dumber. If I don't know it, it doesn't exist. For the Phillies, Severino Gonzalez. Jules. Trinity is next. My bad. I said it wrong. Sorry. Please, don't shoot me. What's up with Godzilla? I've heard really mixed things on Godzilla. I still haven't seen it. Bartolo Colon. Doesn't seem like it's that good. George Springer Mini. You'll have to see tomorrow morning when it goes on sale. Michael Yanoa. Many have tried to, t to get me to tell them the prices before it goes on sale, and many have failed. I never tell. A gentleman never tells the prices of his breaks before they're posted. Cole Stewart, Mini Refractor, Andrew Lambo Ice. It's about a lizard. Luke Jackson. Texas Rangers. John G. You're too fast now, Ryan. All right, last box of Bioman. Now, Canadian Godzilla would just be a slightly large moose. David Holmberg. Jules Reds. Huds, is it true that there's still new episodes of Northern Exposure going on in Canada? Chris Bryant, Top 100. Oh, that wasn't a Canadian show. Tim Hortons. You Darvish Green Paper. Jose Peraza Mini. Daniel Robertson for the A's Refractor, 39 of 500.
Chris Owings mini. Billy Hamilton sparkle. <laughs> Three hour battle. Mac Williamson, Adrian Gonzalez, oh, yeah, it really hasn't been that anything that exciting in this case, huh, Jose Bautista Blue, Mikel Franco, It all change with one pack, one swing of a pack. Travis Darno, top 100. Billy McKinney, Blue Wave Mini. There was one nice gold Jason Hirsch, but Erasmus stole it. Mike Mayers for the Cardinals, Refractor Auto. It's been all the same teams. It's been like Cardinals. Yankees, Red Sox. Eh, there's a few others sprinkled in, but none of the big autos. Anderson Simmons, Orange Paper, Rhymer Liriano, Mini Refractor. <clears throat> We're due for a big case of Bowman, probably tomorrow. Bowman 20, the random, probably be epic. Jonathan Crawford Mini, Chris Sale Ice. <laughs> uh, Jacob Scabuzo. Eric P. Come on, Eric, you got a couple Scabuzos. What more could you want out of life? Last pack. Gary Sanchez Mini, Darno Sparkle. Yeah, not the most exciting case, sorry. <laughs>